If you haven't seen uh, the last uh, handful of videos, here's some of the stuff you missed. Mike, what time is it? <laughs> There it is completed. Now I just gotta figure out where I'm gonna put this. Let's see here. Five years and I'm still right here. Please. No, no, not quite. Hello, Welcome back to the Average Mike Show. Yeah, and on this episode of What Broke on the Truck this week, I'm gonna show you how to change a fuel uh, a fuel pump on a 2000 Silverado 1500. The first thing you're going to want to do is spray your uh, tank straps with some WD-40. Or in my case, some fake WD-40. That should be enough. Um. Oh yeah. Now, all we now we gotta wait a little while. Let this uh, stuff set in. So I'm gonna go have some lunch. I'll be right back. Fifteen millimeter. All right. Yeah, disconnect the, the fill tube. It's just this uh, eight millimeter socket here and this uh, hose clamp. All right, now I got the bolts out. You can see the straps are loose. Uh, carefully, I'm gonna try to get these straps out the rest of the way and set the tank under the ground. Got that one. <laughs> yeah, the yeah the two lines going in and out of the tank yeah, have been disconnected. Now it's just this big honking wiring connector here, and the tank should just about slide out from under the truck. <laughs> Oh wait, oh I got two wire connectors to worry about, okay. There's one. Uh, I'll show you when I get it out. There it is. I got the tank out. That was one hell of a championship fight. <laughs> Ended up uh, breaking the evap line. No, not that big a deal. I still gotta go to buy the part anyways. Yeah, now that we got the tank out, just 
pop this metal ring loose with a hammer and a screwdriver. And look at that, the whole pump assembly just comes out. Uh, oh, you just gotta disconnect these uh, uh, hose, these uh, hoses first. Yeah, strain all that gas back into the tank because we're going to need that gas. Oh, all right, got the pump out. Now I can go up and go back up to AutoZone and uh, see if they ask me for the color of the truck this time. Uh, I'll see you when I get back with a new one. After 120 years of argument and debate, finally there can be peace in America. Whether you prefer underhand, overhand, or you just sit it on the top of the toilet like that. One thing America can finally agree on, we're just glad if it's there. I'm Average Mike, and I approve this message. Now, back to the show. Already in progress. Just got this brand new pump from O'Reilly. And just for good measures, I also uh, sprayed the tank out. Because, well, this truck's been down in Mexico, and, well, the gasoline's not exactly up to par. And so, yeah, it's time to put this together. And hopefully everything fits together right. It should. Oh. Put this ring back on it. Pass me the hammer, please. Yeah, just knock this ring back in. Got it. Okay. Now I just connect these hoses. It doesn't come with these slip fittings already on it. So I'm going to have to take, the, take them off the old one. I'm glad I didn't uh, throw this out yet. Figured just in case something stupid like this came up. I don't think that was actually supposed to, I don't think that was actually supposed to come out of there. <laughs> this is Chevy, so I can't even use my buddy's Ford Tough joke. Yeah, that's correct. Okay. Here's that fit that one. Yeah, okay. Uh oh.
Yeah. <laughs> Got it. Okay. Now this one here is going to be that uh, uh, EVAP line that uh, goes underneath it, but that looks too big for that. Oh boy! Oh, crap! Did I get the wrong pump? There's one that broke off. No, that looks right. Okay. All right. Good. We got the right one. Now we got to put the tank back underneath it. Uh, this is going to be fun. Or at least with it empty, it's not going to be too bad. Yeah, we're almost done uh, with this uh, particular video. Yeah, it's just running a bit longer than I was expecting, so... See, <laughs> <laughs> boy, Yeah, I broke uh, one of the fittings and I've been getting yelled at it for it ever since. Yeah, so, I got this... Uh, Universal vacuum uh, fitting Because I couldn't find the correct one anywhere That's what I get for buying a truck in California and bringing it to Colorado And that's more or less what it's going to look like when it's done. I'm just going to glue everything together before I go and put it back into the truck. See? Yeah, look, that looks pretty good. Alright, uh, yeah. I'll show you the rest of it in the next video. Putting, putting everything back together. I also got to fix this section of exhaust pipe. Yeah, so that'll be the next video. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Actually, there's that smiley face with some broken teeth uh, down over here somewhere. There it is. There it is. Yeah, click on it. Yeah, come on. You know you want to. You know you want to. Like video, mash a thumbs up for me. Appreciate that. Yeah, um, don't forget to hit that share button because I keep forgetting to say that it's right about here. Yeah, uh, if you got any suggestions, anything you want to see in future videos, go ahead and leave that in the comments. I do read them. Till next time, thanks for rolling with Average Mike.